Hello dear friends of Romantic Wings. Today we have a special episode. I updated my Mitsubishi Zero pack and for your waiting I added a new aircraft into it. It's a Nakajima B5N2 uh, nickname is Kate. It was involved in the early stages of the World War II and the attack on Pearl Harbor. So, I wish you a lot of fun. So, we are here on the airfield of Suvanosa Jima RJX-8, which you know already from my Mitsubishi Zero pack. I added some more objects and a new aircraft carrier where we will try to land on. On the weapon selection panel I select a torpedo 800 kilograms. No, no, weapons don't work in the Microsoft Flight Simulator, but we can pretend to use them. <laughs> Parking brake. I release the parking brakes and slowly push the throttle forward. Don't be too hectic. It's a heavy airplane, not to be compared with a Zero. The gear is up and we will slowly turn to find the Shinano carrier. The Shinano was the last and biggest carrier of the Imperial Japanese Navy. Her first and last journey was in November 1944. The American submarine Archerfish sunk her with four torpedoes. I spotted the Shinano. Time for me to slow down, lower gear and set flaps to full. And the, arrest <coughs> the arrestor hook has to be lowered as well. We have to approach at near stall speed to stop the plane before we reached the net barrier in front of the elevator. Bear with me. And I have to get rid of this torpedo under my belly. <laughs> it's gone. Right hand side is the Akagi, ahead of us is Shinano. It's important to keep a certain power setting. If you pull back the throttle too much, the aircraft will drop like a stone at this landing speed. Oh, we lost valuable meters on this bumpy landing. 
We will crash into the barrier, I'm pretty sure. No, we made it without touching the barrier. But how can we turn now for the next takeoff? Let's try it. <laughs> Oops, 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 oops. The wings are stuck in the barrier. I should have folded the wings before turning. <laughs> Let's do it right now. Maybe it works. Hey, we are free again. Beautiful. Power and turn around. Oops, a daisy, what's that? The tail touched the barrier. No escape now. I will end up in a kamikaze unit to save my honor. Ah, powerful machine. Full power brought me back on my feet. Uh, I mean on my wheels. No business as usual. Wings unfolding. Prepare for takeoff. Select some nice weapons now. Six bombs at 60 kilo each will do a nice job when we are hunting down a submarine. Or some houses and cars on roads. Yippee, it's a question of honor. Flaps, take off. Parking brakes set and full power now. The runway isn't too long. It's not a steel deck. It's covered with shock absorbent wood chips. Yes, you heard right, wood chips. We made it. No submarines found. I will land back in Suvanosa Jima. Gear out, flaps down, and away with these dumb bombs. They are gone.
<laughs> that was a bit rough landing. Should keep the power a little longer next time. The navigator and the gunner behind me screamed like hell. They are simply not used to an excellent pilot like me. <laughs> There's the entrance of the parking area. <coughs> we'll turn in here and get some fuel and food. I'm hungry now. I forgot to raise the hook. Now I understand why it was such a rough landing. <laughs> That's the navigator's compartment. At this point my VR goggles gave up. I will show you the rest in 2D, two-dimensional. Don't worry about the enough lights. They are moving now correctly with the folding wing. Let's stop the engine. Ah, the silence is ear deafening. <laughs> Want to hear the engine once more? Just press the starter button. Let's check the available weapons. The torpedo you have already seen, now a single 800 kg armored piercing bomb against ships. Next is a pair of 250 kg bombs. By the way, this long instrument, the right hand side, is not the outside air temperature, but the inclinometer. 
important for torpedo launching. Some more buttons for lights and pitot heat and so on. That's all for now, for now, folks. The Zero Pack will soon be updated. Thanks for watching and have a lovely day.